Okay, guys, we're back. Part four of Sekiro. Last time, we mostly just retraced our steps. We caught up on a mini boss that I missed last time. We met a kindly old lady and also this merchant. How much gold do I even have? 53. We need 100 if we want more info from this guy, which... I don't know. I don't really care that much about it, but... Maybe for story purposes, we should check it out. I'm not sure. Anyway, I think we've done all the backtracking we need to do, and now it's time to move on and keep pushing forward. So let's do that. This is around where we fought our first mini boss, who was kind of a scary ogre type guy. Well, that was easy. Give me some gold here. All right, 75. We're, we're getting close to unlocking that other tidbit here. Yeah, I'm just trying to be a little bit more careful with my exploration and make sure I don't miss anything big because uh, people have definitely informed me that if I take the time and I really explore every nook and cranny, uh, I will find a lot of cool stuff. So we're going to be doing that. Oh, hey there. That was easy. So this guy does a lunging attacks like exclusively, huh? Like straight horizontal things. Another balloon of wealth. I mean, we're getting so many of these. At some point, I should just start popping them. You know, I have that usual thing that a lot of gamers have where like I don't want to use um, consumable items because I'm like, oh, I should save them for a better time. But at some point, it's like you just got to use them. Oh, it looks like there's cool stuff over there. I definitely want to get over there. But how? We'll find a way. So I've been up here before. If I recall, there's an enemy up here. Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let's just try to uh, scope the place out, see what we can see. Uh-oh, who saw me? Oh god, gun guy. Is that a... Oh, it's a little goblin thing? Alright, get out of here. This reminds me a lot of Dark Souls 2, like one of the early areas in Dark Souls 2, there was kind of a layout like this. Oh, I was hoping to get a backstab on that guy, but instead I'm just getting destroyed! Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, bring me back. Okay, we took out the, the hard guy. These bald guys are really easy. You can pretty much just mash. And yeah, there's a uh, mini boss there. Looks like maybe we've successfully avoided his uh, his gaze. Let's eat a pellet here. Oh, wow, he's really coming, huh? Is there some other kind of basic enemy around there? Wow. Oh god, he's on the hunt. Okay, let's drop down. Let's make a lot of noise. More scrap iron. Cool. Is he going to start coming around the other way? What's happening here? I just want to see if I can get like a, a sneak on him. You know? If we go up here. Yeah, there he is. Is this the area where there's that guy? I don't know. Just trying to use stealth to my advantage here, guys. Oh yeah, this is where we were earlier, actually. Okay. There he is. 
sneak up on him. Oh, we got one. Nice. That's a freebie. Oh, jeez. Jeez, Louise. Whoa. He had that, like, locked and loaded. Oh, the stab, the unblockable. That one came out fast. Okay. So we don't have any more reses, right? Okay, well, <laughs> let's work our way back and see if we can beat that guy. Oh, nice. We got unseen aid. So we didn't lose our gold. Maybe now we can go and buy more info from that guy. Maybe now's a good time. Let's just kill the chicken for good luck. Once again, if there's some kind of reckoning for being a chicken murderer, I'm going to be in big trouble. But for now, I'm just going to keep doing it. Oh, he has goods already. Oh, this is pretty nice. Phantom Kunai. Upgrade the loaded shuriken. Dude, this is pretty sick. Uh, I don't really need any of this. I think we'll just buy information. A tube with fire blasting out of it. I need that. Huh. But where can I find it? Alright, we have to find out what the other samurai want. Huh, so here's that memo. In the Harada estate. But like, where though? I don't know. I would really like to have that flame item, but I'm just too dumb to find it. So, uh, let's move on, I guess. Beat these easy enemies. Oh god. We're trading blows with this scrub. Feels bad. So we have to find info on what, what the people, like, want. What the bad guys are after, basically. I mean, they're after the dragon blood, right? The dragon blood is what gives people the ability to regenerate when they die. And that's what they're after. I believe that that is the case. It seems strange I can't jump up there. What is this? It doesn't open from this side. <laughs> oh, right. Because earlier... I was looking over there. I really want to get over there. Because there's like items over there, but... I don't know how. I don't think there's any sort of sneaky, grapply way to get over there. So let's just move forward. Really, our first focus should be killing this mini-boss, right? So let's try to do that. Oh, there's the mini-boss. He's right there. So he's, like, staring directly at you, like, when you... When you pop out of the, that area up there, he's just, like, waiting for you. It'd be nice if enemies could friendly fire each other. Oh, that little goblin. He's ringing the alert, huh? I need to not die here. But it looks like that might be exactly what happened. Oh my god, this is sad. We're just dying to the easiest enemies. Alright, bring me back. 
No! Okay, we got ganged up on real bad. That one <laughs> that one was a gimme, guys. We gotta be more sneaky. We gotta take out that little goblin guy who alerts everybody. That's pretty important. Alright, we're gonna try to be sneaky this time. I'll see what I can do at least. If we like come through here into this tall grass. How did we do it before? We were pretty sneaky before. Maybe we did this route? Is this the way to go? Once again, it's really nice that in this game, nobody looks up. So someone saw us. Oh, that looks very interesting. No, 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 no. Hush. All right, we're going to try going down here. I think this this looks very much like what I'm after in terms of a route to that left side. I really wanted to go over there. Oh, confetti. It drives away apparitions. Allowing attacks to connect with apparitions. So it's like that that creepy hand in uh, Dark Souls 1. How about we keep running? I really don't want to fight all these enemies at once. Turn back if you value your life. You can't behead the headless. Oh, God. There's ghosts this way. Oh, hi. Well, maybe they'll just file in one by one, and then it'll be no problem to take them out. Dude, I don't want to have to fight ghosts. That sounds horrible. But, like... Maybe we have no choice. Well, I mean, obviously we don't have no choice. I could just keep moving, but... Maybe they're, like, over there. I really want to get to that other route from before. <gasps> that, like, left side route. I really want to figure out a way to get there. But, uh... It's not looking too good for places I can go. Maybe I can like grab that ledge. That seems foolish. I don't think I can jump that far. All right, let's try it. <gasps> Guys, <laughs> sometimes you just got a YOLO. Oh my God, how did that work? Climb. Okay. Sugar. Suppresses sound. Making yourself harder to detect. Wow, there's so little fall damage. Okay, so we might get killed by ghosts here. This is pretty scary. To be quite honest. It seems we're descending into some kind of tomb. Maybe I'll suppress my footstep sounds. Do you think that sounds like a good idea? What? Why can't... Do I have to put it here or something? Okay. Oh, maybe I can't while I'm crouching. I bet that's it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Our footsteps are suppressed. So maybe ghosts won't hear us. Thankfully, I read on a tooltip that um, our character has low light vision. Well, so this is the way out, but let me just explore a little bit more, see if there's anything good in here. There's something down there. That looks like a ghost. All right, let's just move on for now. Let's just bail. I don't want to die to ghosts. I'm afraid. Wait, where now? The, oh, that's the entrance, huh?
What is Poison Gecko? I don't like that. Another one? I do not want to save money on my car insurance by switching to Geico, bro. Okay, more of that sugar. Oh, nice. Antidote powder. Divine grass. Restores vitality and cures all status abnormalities. Wow. And this is that door that only opens from that side? Did we complete the loop? Yes! That's very satisfying. So that's good. Now we can fight this boss without too much fear. Let's get our healing gourd out. Okay, so what's the strat here? Who saw me? Gun guy. Alright, let's sneak over to him. It's that goblin we killed earlier. Okay, took him down. Come on. Get over there. I blocked that. Nice. Okay, we got the parry. Take out this gun guy. Oh, that's the boss, isn't it? I don't like that. I don't like that, boys. Come on, we gotta, we gotta take out the other guy first. Jeez! 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 What? <laughs> that was horrible. It was like he... I, I was just dodging, but he kept tracking them. Okay, we're fine. Oh! Oh! Okay, that went badly. That went badly. Oh my god, guys. Alright, I really want to take out this boss, and then I'll be satisfied moving on. The trick is, like, getting over there is really hard. Because enemies see me so fast. Like, I feel like this route is good. Wow, is this guy actually blind? Okay, well, that was handy. Yeah, you guys are fine. Oh, that little goblin's ringing that bell. Uh-oh. Now every enemy for miles around is coming to see what's going on. I honestly, like, still suck at fighting these basic enemies. Nice. Got lucky there. Who's behind me? Just a normal guy. Okay, let's absorb all this crap and then try to find a place to hide. You there. You sir as well. Ow! Okay, well, the boss found us, but we've taken everyone else out, so we're not in too horrible a shape here. Eat a pellet. Maybe we can fistful of ash this guy. That did not work. Let's try it again. No, fistful of ash, not pellet. Jeez, good lord. Okay, let's, let's prep our healing gourd. May as well just use it, I guess. Ow. 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 Okay. Healing gourd. Okay, last second jump there. Missed my parry window. 
No, no, no. No. Oh, he got it off. Damn, I want to eat a pellet because, like, I don't really want to die is the thing. No, no. <gasps> okay, he got one life bar. I'm out of pellets. Maybe I can like spam shurikens on him or something. Oh, oh, I got a miracle parry on that or something? No. No, you don't. Damn, the <laughs> the following. The seeking. Oh, we were so close. Oh, but we have resurrect. What am I talking about? We're good. Famous last words. No. No healing. Who will get him? Bros. We actually did it! Oh! Bros, I feel like such a god, dude. Oh my god, that was scary, man. We used all our consumables, but we got him. I completely forgot about Resurrect. I was like, well, I guess this is how I die. Nice, well, where to now? This is the furthest we've been in the game so far. So this thing's out. Oh. There's a save thing down there, but... Who saw me? Where's there an enemy? I don't know. Excellent. Well, I feel like we have to rest, man. Purchase spirit emblems? Oh, that's just... That's just ammo for, like, my shurikens and stuff. Enhance physical attributes. But how do I use my skill points? That's something I don't understand. I don't know. We'll have to figure that out next time. But for now, I'm very happy with the progress we made today, guys. We found some pretty nice items and all that nonsense. And now uh, we're ready to actually push forward with the game. What? There was a lizard here this whole time? Oh my god. Anyway, can we... Okay, let's rest so we don't die to poison. Anyway, we're ready to push on, so that's pretty exciting, guys. Uh, so I will catch you in the next episode. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. I know I am. So I will see you then. Bye, everybody.